Namaste my students welcome back to the class today in this video i am going to discuss mcq fill in the blanks and the question answer of chapter 7 more on internet so let us begin you will take out page number 92 of your book we will we are going to solve this mcq web pages on the web can be dashed by anyone option a read web pages cannot be dele deleted or modified but it can be read by anyone so tick the option a internet is like a big library okay where you can gather an information it is not a shop or a home but it is like a big library put a tick mark over here now you are going to take out page number 97 see you are going to solve the exercise first we are going to solve the section a quiz number a quiz name the founder of google what we have learned sergey brin and larry page they are the founder of google who developed linux in 1991 linus torvalds you have to write it down you have to write it down in your copy number b tick the correct option to learn in an environment where the teachers and students are not needed at the same place is called online education put a tick mark over here In DAS cloud, a distinct and secure and secure cloud-based environment is used by single organization, that is private. Put a tick mark. DAS are the nodes and guidelines provided for installing and using the features of an application. Its documentation. You have to put a tick mark over here. Number four, DAS is a free and open source operating system. Linux. Linux is a free and open source operating system. Put a tick mark. Number C. Internet has a great dash on our society. Great impact. Dash is a special software available to download files from internet downloaders. The goal of cloud computing is to provide easy access of resources. Dash means all rights reserved. That's a copyright. Okay. This is the symbol of copyright. And also write it down. Copy copyright. Okay. You have to write the word copyright. copyright means all rights reserved now come to section b give two example for each of the following number a search engine website google or and the bing okay they are the search engine website number b people finder website you have to write www.pipel.com and next is www.lullar that is lullar.com okay Now number two, what is downloading? Let us see. You will take out page number ninety-three. Downloading is the method by which you can access files, software, and other information from a remote computer using internet. So this is answer number two. Question number three: List any three safety measures that one should follow while using the internet. Let us see. See this page number ninety-six. Here safety measures are given. Seven safety measures are given. You have to write any three for the answer number three. Okay. Number four. How do you copy the text from a web page to a document? You will come to page number eighty nine. See this. To copy a text from a web page, follow the given steps. Step one: select the text you want to copy from a web page by dragging the mouse over the text. Step two: right click and select the copy option. Step three: Now open the document where you want to paste paste the selected text. Step four: Click paste from the clipboard group of Home tab, or you can also write a uh, press Control plus V from the keyboard. So, this is the way you will be uh, copying the text from a web page and also write down this answer. Now, question number five: How do you save a picture from a web page to your hard text? See. This is page number ninety. How to save an image from the web page to your hard text? What you have to do? See this one. Open any search engine and click the image option. Okay. And now, for example, you can write this one. Type the name of the image you are searching for. Click the search button. You get a number of images. Click the suitable images to open it. Right click on the image and select Save Image as option. Select the folder location in the Save As dialog box and specify the file name. And step seven, click the Save button. You have to write down all this for this answer. Next, 
how is internet used in the field of education you can write that internet is used for the online education many educational institute from all over the world provide online educational facility and internet make it possible to learn, learn in an environment where the teachers and students are not de- needed so distant education can be possible using the internet then come then we'll, then you will also write that online exam ca- is possible using this internet a student can give the online exam with a, with the computer and with an internet connection then the virtual lab virtual lab is an interactive environment for con- conducting experiment in various bra- in various branches of science science uh, how it is possible using this internet so you can write that using this internet online education is possible online exam is possible and also to conduct the virtual lab also number 7 explain the search process to get effective search result and number 8 is explain cloud computing and its type let us see the number 7 you will open you will open the page number 88 and see over here searching tips and techniques you will write it down all this one okay how to search you have to write down all this technique as well as the uses you can write the example but you have to write this technique and uses next come what is explain the cloud computing and its time let us see this page number 93 cloud computing is a technology that uses the internet to maintain data and application cloud computing provides software data access and storage services to the user as per the location of their preferences duration of their liking and application of their choice the word cloud in cloud computing refers to the internet the goal of cloud computing is to provide easy access of resources for example you can access your email whenever uh, wherever and whenever you need it because your email is stored on the cloud you have to write till here then also write types of cloud no need of explaining it just write the name of the types of cloud that is public cloud private cloud community cloud and hybrid cloud so here we have completed the um, question answer under the section b so student this is the end of the video with this the chapter number 7 is completed go through it and complete your work in your copy neatly thank you namaskar